So the question is, uh, you have been an amazing tech philanthropist. Please tell us about the biggest success in this area. Now, where I come from, which is Pakistan, we're humble, we're told to be staying, stay humble, right? And you're not supposed to brag about yourself, which is totally North American, right? But um, since you asked that question, um, I think what was my biggest success in being a tech philanthropist was that I found myself. I found my own calling and desire to teach, to change myself, become a better person. And that is what I think was the reward for, for doing all this. But having said that, I think uh, Rehan School was phenomenal. We did a lot of videos on um, teaching a lot of people on how to use technology. Uh, the, the problems in Pakistan are very different than the rest of the world because Pakistan has a very low literacy rate. Out of the 200 million people Pakistan has, only 30% can read and write their own name even. So forget about um, uh, a high-end technology to be created. We needed to fix the fundamentals of, uh, of the country. So I created a school with the goal of teaching 140 million people how to read and write basic English and Urdu language, which is the national language of Pakistan. So I created uh, a school in a box for $15 with a stupid phone inside, not a smartphone, a basic phone, uh, with pre-loaded videos from celebrities on it. And that was a very, very interesting thing. Later on, that became into an app, which is called Rehan School English, uh, which people can download and learn English from it. And now we're uh, coming up with an AI-based uh, Rehan School English, which is literally a teacher in your phone, which will talk to you, chat with you, communicate with you, and educate you at the same time. So I think that is uh, one of, going to be one of the biggest thing uh, which is yet to come. And God knows what's going to come. My dream is to create Samantha in the movie Her eventually for the planet so we can have an AI which can go and learn and teach us because uh, I never went to regular college or university to learn. I always use mentors and information, fragmented information around the globe to create whatever I thought I sh there sh that should, that's how the world should be. So if we can actually have a Samantha on our phone and our computers, which can go and learn for us and teach us, uh, I think that will be phenomenal. So that's my that's my goal uh, now for creating that in the AI space.